welcome back everybody to an all new fast food pit stops. I'm your host, Justin. I'm here in Asheville, North Carolina at Schlotsky's Deli for the first time. You'll just have to trust me. They're in the background somewhere here. This is actually a brand new Schlotsky's location. I think it's the first here in Asheville, actually. So I was excited when they announced the location opening here and I wanted to come down and check out one of their new specialty sandwiches. They have seven new specialty sandwiches and the one that popped out at me was the new bacon grilled cheese sandwich. It's got four types of cheeses, crispy bacon, tomato, lettuce, and it's on a soft pretzel roll. And it also comes with a side of tomato dipping sauce in it. So we're gonna check it out. Let's get into it. $7.99 for the bacon grilled cheese sandwich. There's a location in Asheville. It actually says Arden, North Carolina. Locals know what the deal is. It's Asheville. So they're actually calling this a tomato basil dipping sauce. Let's check that out. There it is. Oh, it's nice and hot. Oh wow, it's thick like soup. It looks really fantastic. So this is the dipping sauce. I see all types of like onions and herbs going on in there, super thick. Oh man, it smells good, like a nice creamy tomato soup, you know what I mean? But here's what we're here for, the bacon grilled cheese sandwich from Schlotsky's on a really nice, supposedly soft artisan pretzel roll. I can tell you got that nice pretzel roll and I can already smell it. it smells like a pretzel. Take a look. Looks like they cut it in half here for us. So I'm gonna go ahead and split it open. They did all the dirty work. Four types of cheeses on this, on this bacon grilled cheese. Munster, provolone, Swiss, and Parmesan. Tell me down in the comments below, what do you think about that? $7.99, eight bucks, you guys, just for the sandwich. Got the different cheese in between. There's the lettuce. Well, actually, no lettuce. I think I said lettuce earlier. It's not a BLT. It's a bacon grilled cheese. Who puts lettuce on a grilled cheese sandwich? But they do add avocado here, and that's what comes with it, of course. Pieces of avocado, the tomato, and that crispy bacon. Sort of semi-soft. Oh, we're screaming, squeezing out avocado. Semi-soft pretzel roll. Let's go ahead and take a bite here. A first bite, big bite of the bacon grilled cheese from Schlotsky's new part of their seven new sandwiches, their specialty sandwiches. Big bite. Mm. It's definitely got that nice thick tomato slice in there, which is always a pleasure to see. The Munster, of course, is a really nice, creamy, sort of soft cheese. It melts down really great. One of the classics that I love putting in a grilled cheese sandwich. The Parmesan, of course, adds a little bit of bite to it. Mm. It all pretty much blends well. The cheese itself has a really nice, actually a sort of a strong flavor, probably because it has like that Parmesan in there as well as the Swiss. So it's all white cheese, which is important to note here. You're not seeing like any type of yellow cheese or anything like that. So it kind of mixes in that pretzel roll has a very distinct pretzel flavor, almost like you're biting into like one of those Auntie Anne pretzels from the mall. Sands the salt, there's no salt or anything on top, so you don't get that real salty effect. The avocado is almost indiscernible in this, but I was sort of hoping for like almost kind of a big sandwich like it showed in the pictures. I think this is gonna be one of those cases where you don't get what you always see in the advertisement, which is typical. Let's dip it in some of this uh, tomato basil dipping sauce. Don't spill it, Justin. You guys want to see that so bad. Nice and warm on a snowy day. Can you guys see all the snow in the background? Cheers. Mm. Oh, wow. That's that really nice grilled cheese tomato soup on a cold snowy day. That's exactly the kind of taste I was looking for here. It actually really amps up the sandwich. So the sandwich again by itself, $8, you guys. It comes with this little dipping sauce that could honestly pass for a little cup of tomato soup. It's that good. The sandwich by itself is tasty. I wouldn't say it's certainly anything that's probably gonna fill you up. You'd probably have to get some sides or salad or something else here. I could easily see racking up the bill at Schlotsky's for this to make this a full-size meal that somebody like me would probably enjoy. That being said, the sandwich size being sort of small, it is very delicate and savory tasting. It's a nice, amped up, adult-sized grilled cheese sandwich with the bacon, four types of artisan cheeses in there, and that really fantastic looking and frankly tasting pretzel roll. There, of course, is the bacon. You see 
really not a lot of bacon on this and it advertises it as having you know thick crispy strips of bacon i'm seeing kind of that thin fake and bacon thing going on the avocado itself uh wasn't actually super ripe looking i'm not sure how it's going to come across in the video but i'll tell you that it's almost like a, a yellow color and it's sort of firm you see see how it's kind of stringy there on the end almost like a piece of fruit it's not quite ripe it's a little too firm so it doesn't sort of develop that really nice avocado flavor that you're used to for the sandwich for itself the bacon grilled cheese sandwich i'm gonna have to give this honestly probably like a four and a half it's certainly not bad i just would have liked to have seen it be maybe a little bit bigger have a little more uh, bacon maybe thicker crispier bacon and to be honest with you i almost wouldn't mind having a little bit of salt i guess on the pretzel to sort of get that full pretzel mouth effect when you dip this into this tomato basil dipping sauce however it really changes things up look how thick that is nice and warm look at it not even a drop super thick it's like soup it's really really good mm. adding the tomato basil dip slash soup to this grilled cheese on a cold day was a perfect mix when you add that in here on a scale of one to ten it amps this thing up to honestly about a six which i know still doesn't seem like a super high rating and it's not because the dip the soup whatever you want to call it can't do too much to help this out but it does bring about that nice winter feel the perfect flavor for this season and it is really good and i could absolutely just eat this thing with a with a spoon i might have one here this is going to be at a last bite big bite of the bacon grilled cheese sandwich one of the new specialty sandwiches from schlotzky's if you have one in your area let me do it out in the comments below my first time coming here i really enjoyed it i'd love to come back you guys they have a lot of really cool looking stuff if you'd like for me to come back to schlotzky's let me know down in the comments below i'm gonna do it a last bite big bite other than that thanks again everybody for checking out another great review here on fast food pit stops i'm your host justin you know you love it you came back for some more of it i'll be back for another fast food review bye everybody Big bite. Mmm.